some shit, man. But I be on my shit, man. I decided that what you give is what you give me. So I've been trying to do it right. I've been doing like whatever gets me through the night. What a lie. Welcome to another video with Jatera Brianne. Um, this is my morning routine dedicated to health and wellness. So we are about to get into some skincare and some dental hygiene. Recently, I've been doing this oxy pulling method where I mouthwash. It's basically like an oil pull. It's really great for removing bacteria. And then I'm going to follow that with another antibacterial mouthwash in addition to a charcoal tooth powder um this video was not sponsored i think these items are from garner's garden and i'm not gonna lie they taste disgusting like i really could throw up but when i tell you they just help with your breath you're supposed to like brush your teeth as you use the mouthwash and the powders together and it's really a disgusting experience i'm not gonna cap and then you follow that with like brushing your teeth regularly but it works my smile has never been brighter my teeth have never been whiter um and i just want to become my healthiest version of myself so doing this dental hygiene routine in addition with my skincare just makes me feel like i'm doing all the right things to take care of myself inside and out i want to smell good and look good on all levels y'all know y'all have been seeing my um skincare routine in a lot of my vlogs so i'm not gonna get too deep into them if you guys have any recommendations on cleansers or products in general please comment them down below because i want to get into double cleansing just because i think my skin has gotten used to the cerave cleanser but this video is not supposed to be dedicated to the products i really just want to rap to you guys about why i felt filming this morning routine was so important we are about to enter a new year and when it comes to in spring 2023 i want to be the best version of myself that i could possibly be and in terms of manifesting who you want to become i think it's really important to step into the shoes that you want to fulfill right now things that you see yourself doing in the future start to do them right now so you can train your your mind your mental state your well-being just train yourself in general and become that person now so when you really tap into your higher self it feels natural and it feels like a breeze also these products right here now they are really important if you want to get rid of hyperpigmentation and putting an oil on top of your moisturizer so your perfume sticks to it that's like my key step but anyways back to my little um i don't want to call it a rant I want to call it manifesting with you guys and I want us to become exactly who we want to be and the only way we can do that is showing God that we are capable of achieving it you know so in the future I see myself being a boss ass bitch I don't know about y'all but I'm tapping into that girl I'm tapping into her right now as we speak so when everything else aligns in my life, it'll feel like a breeze. And the woman that I see myself becoming, she has a soft life. She does everything with ease. She takes care of herself nonstop. She pours into herself like no other. Because before you can pour into someone else's cup, you have to be filled in order to do that. You can't be on empty. You can't be running on E trying to give to everybody else. What a love. Coming from that pretty mouth 
the truth is fitting Cause you ain't never talking loud and you know plenty You know what I'm talking about cause you just get me Yeah, you so pretty If everything is dipped in gold Then baby it will never grow Everything sweet ain't sugar do y'all hear Janae right now what a life that I am living like I just want to show gratitude and thanks because last year I didn't have this apartment last year I wasn't in a healthy mental state and it's all about manifesting and seeing what you can achieve and making it happen um I do want to take the time to show y'all that drinking this tea has gotten my digestive system in track. I'm going to talk to y'all about it a little bit later. And in the morning, I just like to take the time to check my emails, to do some editing, because I don't know if y'all know this, but I'm approaching 50k subscribers on youtube and i just want to make sure that i stay dedicated and consistent i love the community that i have been able to create on this channel so that be my first number one priority in the morning and then i respond to sponsorships that i have a journal i manifest i write things down that i want to achieve for the week um i think this morning I planned out my content for November. If you are a content creator, I highly suggest you doing this. Just noting everything that you want to do in terms of videos and just make sure you get it done. I also take the time to read. This was a weekend, y'all, FYI. So I got a late start because I definitely had a little hangover from the night before. Boy, we had a time last night. But um, the woman I see myself becoming is very knowledgeable and reading helps me achieve that. Hey y'all, I cannot believe this is my first time talking to y'all throughout the entire video, like face to face. So, first off, let me start by saying hello. Thank y'all so much for clicking on today's video. Are you new here? If you are, my name is Jessica Brianne. It's so nice to meet you. Make sure you subscribe. So yeah, please comment down below right now if y'all like montages. Like, I'm talking to you, babe. Yes, I'm talking to you, the person who is watching this video right now. Please comment down below and tell me if you actually like the montages where I don't talk a lot throughout the like first part of the, uh, of the video. Because I tend to create content that I know I like to see personally and I love when the girlies like Aaliyah's face and Kyra I'm unique when they do the montages because they're really soothing to me but I understand those those type of videos may not float or by boat sorry I'm like <laughs> getting ready to eat my breakfast right now but yeah comment down below and tell me if you like them or if you want me to talk a little bit more throughout them just let me know what kind of content you'd like to see from me and if you comment say thank you because i'm really asking y'all for y'all input right now but yeah y'all saw me get ready throughout the day that has been my routine for like the past two three weeks for real, for real. no i'm capping like one to two weeks and and it's just really important for me to like get on my health shit. I don't know if it's because I turned 25 and now I feel like I'm old or something. Even though I know I'm not. But I'm really trying to get on top of my physical health inside and out. So right now I'm making a quick breakfast. Y'all probably going to be like, ew, but I like softball eggs. And um, eggs are really good for you. And I didn't know that at first. So I try to eat them daily. I'll do two eggs in the morning with hot sauce and salt and pepper and i eat it along with my health aid kombucha that i got from trader joe's because this kind of smells like apple cider vinegar to me i'm not sure if it's because it's the pink lady apple flavor or what it tastes good it's just stink um so i can't like really eat it 
I mean, I can't drink it on an empty stomach, so that's why I drink it along with my eggs. But let me tell you something right now. If you wake up in the morning and you take a shot of lemon juice and you drink you some tea, some warm tea, your insides are going to thank you later because you're going to go straight to the bathroom and you're going to get all those toxins and bad things out your body and you're going to be straight. Um, and right now I'm about to fuel myself because I'm about to go to the gym, hence my outfit. <laughs> I'm trying to show y'all the bottoms, but... I'm that type of person that cannot work out on an empty stomach. I have to have something in my stomach before I work out. But, yeah. Everything that I did in this video so far is supposed to aid to your health and your wellness. So, the y'all saw me, like, do a lot of dental hygiene. Um, I'm really trying to get on top of my teeth because I am trying to do a cosmetic change soon. I ain't getting no fucking veneers, okay? I don't play with that. I just want to get my wisdom teeth taken out and I want to get Invisalign. I have to get my wisdom teeth taken out before I get my Invisalign. Uh, but regardless, you should be on top of your new hygiene all the time. Because, seriously. And that um routine that I did, I only do it like once a month. I'm not sure if I said that earlier. And I tend to do it also if I know I'm going to eat something that like, like smells really bad. Like if I have anything with raw onions, I'll do that the night before. You wake up with no morning breath whatsoever. Like, your breath will not be hot in the morning. I, I kid you not. If you do that, if you do oil pulling or any type of, like, charcoal teeth cleanse, you will wake up with the freshest breath. It's insane. And then my skincare has been the same. Um, I want to add to my skincare. So, if you guys have any recommendations on, like, eye cream and other moisturizers, let me know because... Basil, it's the winter season. You want to make sure that you always moisturize, like, even more than you do on a regular because the winter weather can dry your skin out so, so much. And I'm also about to go on a trip. So, I need my skin to be clear so I don't have to wear as so much makeup. And, um, the things that I'm eating and drinking are also showing in my skin. Like, my skin is flawless right now except for this pimple because I'm like on my cycle. But anyways, yeah, y'all. That wraps up this video for real, for real. I'm about to eat my eggs <laughs> and drink my kombucha. And then I'm going to head to the gym. And yeah, that really wraps up my morning routine. And then I just have busy work to do for the rest of the day. So yeah, thank y'all so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed please comment down below because I will film these more frequently for you guys. Um, make sure you hit the like button, give me a big thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, mamas. Yeah.